guys and welcome back to another video so i am excited for today's video because i am going to be reviewing this product right here i have never tried this product but a week ago i saw it at the store and i was like i really want to try it but here's the thing they had like the lightest colors at the store that i saw it i think it was like at walgreens i haven't touched it i haven't like tried it it's not used but i'm going to review it with you guys and try it out for my first time the only product that i really only use on my eyebrows like my ride or die product is the anastasia beverly hills zip brow but i haven't gone to buy a new one and this one really really intrigued me fun fact i bought this at my school's bookstore because they actually had the darkest color which is espresso which looks like this it's a good amount let's compare her to the anastasia dip brow color don't come at me okay it's like i need a new one asap i feel like the colors look pretty similar i think they look pretty similar i think this one so this one has 0 0.14 ounces and this one has 0 0.19 ounces so this one, the e.l.f. one, actually has more than Anastasia Dip Brow look. Right here. And I don't think you're going to be able to tell that it says 14 ounces, but it says right there. Yeah, there's no way that you're going to be able to tell. If you have your own Dip Brow, Anastasia Dip Brow, go see that it's 14 ounces. So let's just get right into it so i'm going to just use my anastasia brush so the way that i do my brows is that i first line the bottom so i don't begin the line all the way from the front like right here i started halfway because then I feel like it's too harsh and it, it, it's kind of, I don't know, harder to blend out. So far, so good. Usually like now I've kind of been doing my brows with like powder or like eyeshadow powder because I feel like it just looks a little bit more natural and I haven't, I haven't really been feeling the super like filled in eyebrow with the pomade so i've been using my i think i showed it in another video my powders like i've been using this palette and i've just been using these two browns right here and then i just clean them up but for today i'm going to do them like i would do them like well, for today, I am going to fill them in like with straight dip brow, shaded in, all that. So then I'm just going to begin lining my top like so. I'm so, so shook. It's actually really smooth. And it glides on, it looks so good. It looks like the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade. By the way guys, it is so rainy today, as you guys can see, and it's beautiful. I love when it's raining. It is my favorite weather. Look at it guys, look at it. Wow, I'm not disappointed at all. 
So we're gonna fill it in now, guys. I'm going to try not to make it so dark. So now I'm just going to start brushing it just so it looks a little bit more natural. So now that it's filled in, um, I'm going to clean it up. Elf, you got Misha. So I paid four dollars for it. Probably because it was at my school bookstore and they be taxing up in there. But if you guys buy it from Target, you guys will actually get it for $3, I believe. And if you guys don't, don't come at me like that. But <laughs> I searched it up and yeah, it is, it should be $3. Let's be honest. Look at it. I'm so shook. I'm going to clean the top now. Guys, I am so in love with how it's looking. I'm gonna go finish the other eyebrow and finish my whole face and I will be right back to give you guys my face. I'm not done with my face yet, but... Guys... Let's look at the eyebrows before I go and finish everything else. This is the first brow that we did together. This is the second brow that I did off camera. So far, this product has me shook. So far, this is getting a 10 out of 10. I'm gonna go finish my whole face and then I'm gonna be right back to finish this video and tell you guys my final hey guys. So my makeup is finally complete. I did some eyeliner. Nothing crazy because this video is about the brows and the product. Just to let you guys know what I use, if you guys have any questions, I use the Fenty Beauty Foundation. I concealed with my Revolution Concealer. I used my Wisp Highlighter by ColourPop. For eyeliner, I use my Wet n Wild Mega Liner. This is my absolute favorite because this little brush right here it's not like individual strands it's like a whole like sponge together which makes doing eyeliner so easy eyelashes i am using indie style love bug i believe and i also got them from this website called sunflower lashes so now let's get straight into what i think about the product I feel like you guys already know what I'm going to say about the product. I really, really, really liked it. I'm not going to wear it all day because I don't really have anywhere to go today. So I'm just going to take it off after I'm done with this video. But it is smooth. It goes on smoothly. It matches my hair perfectly it reminds me so much of the anastasia de brow pomade it's really good it's affordable it glides on really good it has a good amount of product i will definitely be using this product again definitely really good for a four dollar product or three dollar product you buy it at target yeah guys that is going to be it for today i hope you guys enjoyed um, make sure to follow me on instagram because i do have some videos in mind that i want you guys to vote on and let me know what you guys want to see if you guys do try this product let me know if you guys like it as well because i absolutely loved it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in my next video